Here is a full day in the life of an 18-year-old student entrepreneur. For public accountability, it is uh, 6.14 a.m. Two things you definitely have to have in your morning routine, making your bed and morning hydration. Absolutely killers. Today I'm going to show you how a chill work day in my life as a 17-year-old student entrepreneur, YouTuber, whatever it is that you call it, looks like. Let's get started. Then I put on my socks and make my way to the bathroom for classical morning rituals like doing my hair and brushing my teeth. One thing I have been experimenting for the last couple of weeks that really increased my productivity is really changing into some really nice clothing in the morning. So that even though I am not going to get out of the house for that day, I will have the motivation to work and to study. Never ever forget starting with the prayer of the day because of course Allah is first. Then we get to the backbone of my morning routine which is my Quran reading, my journaling and my absolute important deep work sessions. For Saturdays and Sundays, my deep work sessions are generally 120 minutes, two hours long, completely uninterrupted. So as you guys know, I talk about journaling a lot on my channel because it is something that I do every single day and it is something that I really value because it is just really valuable for your life when it comes to your productivity, when it comes to literally everything in your life, especially your mental health, mental clarity. So now I am going to show you something really special and that's really meaningful to me. Let me bring them. So these are all the journals that I used to have uh, that I actually filled out. Let me count how many there are. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And this is the one that I'm using at this point. And this is the number one reason why I solved all my mental clarity issues, why I solved all my mental health issues, why I found out what I am passionate about. And this is going to change your life if you do that consistently. Every single morning or every single evening, whatever it is for you, journal every single day and you guys are like asking me what do you do in your journal uh, like you can write about literally whatever you want you can write about how your day went or how you are feeling or a problem that you have but just write because if you write your feelings down and if you also keep like a gratitude journal which are great journals that I have are gratitude journaling so many things that I wrote here because it is life-changing and I hated that a lot of people are not doing it more uh, gonna get back to my deep work sessions but just wanted to mention that. In today's deep work session, I'm working something that's really exciting that's going to be coming up in the hopefully near future, so stay tuned for that. Another thing you can realize is I haven't checked my phone until 9.41 a.m. That is key to productivity, guys. So it is 9.41 a.m. and I woke up at 6.30 a.m. and that means it is essentially more than three hours of my morning routine and my morning deep work sessions where I never touched my phone. Your phone is absolutely your productivity killer and that's why I haven't touched my phone since I woke up from yesterday. Because of the fact that my family generally wakes up late, we have breakfast late and that's why I have that one hour reading session in the morning on weekends and I really enjoy that because it's chill and it's really awesome why are you like kind of dressed so that's gonna be the lesson number two change your clothes absolutely directly after you wake up so that you can get into that work or day state so now I'm gonna go and have breakfast with my family because I'm starving it's been literally four hours since I woke up and I definitely need to eat it looks like my brother woke up let me go find him probably watching TV or something <laughs> yeah last one you know Aiden go ahead now Then we are back with the second deep work session, which is going to be also 120 minutes. So in total for that day, I got four hours of incredible deep work done. And then I got to scripting two videos that I was supposed to shoot that day. And I actually shot them like it wasn't a problem. 
So now here is what we're gonna do. I have a meeting with my YouTuber friends uh, Dimitri and Sean at 2 p.m. That means until then I have to shoot these two videos that I just scripted here. Now we're gonna shoot those two videos back to back and get things, get those footage to the computer and then join the meeting. So we gotta be fast but we gotta be precise as well. Let's get them done. And today is actually becoming a very, very productive day, to be honest. This was supposed to be a chill day, but yeah, uh, it doesn't matter, man. Let's get some work done. I'm getting excited now. Let's shoot these videos. So I get a lot of questions about how I shoot my videos. I am going to show you that. So here is where I'm going to be sitting in this video. The camera is going to be on this tripod. This is a tripod that I have been using like for the last, it's been a one and a half years, the start of my YouTube channel. And then we have this secondary ring light here. And if I turn this big light off, look how everything is going to change. Like this is a big light, big lighting here. A light here is going to be also a secondary light. mind you're gonna be also in the video <laughs> if it's okay so guys I'm just out of my call with Dimitri and Sean uh, Sean is doing some really good things he is essentially going full-time with this YouTube channel which is really exciting and now I have to essentially get my workout in my daily workout today is uh, back and biceps today is back and biceps and I'm not gonna go to the gym today so I have to figure out what I have to do at home it doesn't matter if you're not gonna go to the gym like I'm not gonna go to the gym today you still gotta get your health checked in and let's do that right now working out is absolutely an important part of my life and I I have been working out for one and a half years consistently. Working out has changed my life. It's gonna get so much benefits to your life. If you are not working out three, four days a week, you definitely should. You're gonna see some amazing benefits. And as you can see, I sometimes also like to go with the flow and dance to the music I'm listening to while I'm working out. Of course, then I take a shower and change my clothes so that I'm not gonna be smelling the whole day. Then this is something that I've been wanting to do for a long time. I'm currently building my self-improvement wall for 2022. That's something that I've been really waiting for, so it's gonna be enjoyable. We're gonna be creating those things today. The wall is cleared for the new ones. Okay, we're done with these. So I'm making this room really, really dark so that I can sit here and meditate and think about how my 2022 looks like. The app that I'm currently using is Meditopia. After I visualize my goals for 2022 and think about them, I sit down and set my goals for it and I'm gonna be hanging them on my wall later that day. My mom dropped off these fruits by the way, so thanks mom. So here, as you can see, I actually am going to be hanging these out. One of them is a quote. Another one is my goal for 2022, which is 100,000 subscribers. 100,000 subscribers in 2022. That is going to be the goal. The main goal I'm going to strive towards in 2022, getting this channel to 100,000 young, ambitious people who wants more in life. Every time I wake up, every time I am in my room, I want to see that 100K and remember that I have a goal and that I'm striving towards to impact other people so now I'm gonna take some time to answer some of your comments as you just saw from there and I got like a lot of comments to answer and as you guys know I answer every single one of my comments on my channel which is something that I do that other youtubers don't and while I'm doing that I'm gonna be watching some of my favorite creators here on YouTube so that it's gonna be a little more entertaining and then I answer every single one of the comments that I got for that week and it takes a pretty long time to be honest and then I get to my evening routine routine which consists of journaling, planning the next day, and then meditation for 5 to 10 minutes generally, and then reading a book, and then going to sleep of course. And that's basically it. Here's a whole day in my life as a 17 year old student entrepreneur slash youtuber, whatever you want to call it. I believe in you, I love you, I support you, keep crushing it, uh, and I'll see you in the next one.